Hello people, it's Stephanie Stevens here. Today I am going to teach you um, how I do my makeup, foundation, and powder. Really simple. And a lot of the times I just use any old foundation, as um, long as it's kind of light. Because you, when you're on your stage, it doesn't really matter if, you're, if you have a lighter foundation or a darker foundation. As long as it's blended enough to where it looks like your skin tone, you're all good to go. So tonight I'm going to show you an extreme uh, makeup foundation and powder look, finish look that I would do just in case if I ran out of makeup and I needed to use a lighter skin person's makeup or one of my white friends their makeup if I had to use their foundation I'm gonna teach you how I would do the look for my face for the show but before I do that I'm gonna do two things I'm gonna start off like I said again with my Vaseline advanced repair because it's what's been evening out all of my skin as I've told you many times, a lot of times I take a dry razor to my face and put my put my um to shave because what that does is it removes all that dead skin. It looks dark and stuff here, but with the Vaseline repair care in about a week or two, it makes your skin totally even and beautiful. And the dry razor removes all that dead skin, dead makeup, all that stuff that's been just sitting on there. And then you get a nice tone. I used to be really dark here, really dark and everything. And this really made a difference, okay? Really made a difference. And because you're rubbing the brushes on your face, you're not gonna get it totally perfect because you're, it's like abrasion on your skin. So, I use the Vaseline Advanced Repair. And in about a week or two, you'll see the difference in your face. Okay, we're gonna continue on now. Um, the second first thing I do is I check my nose. You don't want any nose hair, so get your nose hair remover. Y'all hear that? Don't poke it in there too much if you don't want to hit a blood vessel. Let me get all the hairs out of your nose. Okay. Oh, I know y'all hear that. <laughs> it was <really> funny. <laughs> but you have to do it when you're in the first committee. You have to make sure that there's no nose hairs in your nose. Because mainly when you're close to people, they can see that. I've seen some of y'all. <laughs> and the whole time I'm looking at you like. Those aren't nose hairs, are they? 
I don't say nothing. I'm just looking right at him, poking out at me, doing one of these. So no nose hairs. Get you one of these. Get you one of these. They have them at Shoppers. This is the Con Air one. I haven't met any beauty supply store. Okay. There you go. Oh, I see the hair. I don't hear anything. I don't hear anything. Oh, there we go. Okay. I am good to go. Good to go. So get you one of these Con Air or any anyone. They sell them even at Walmart nose trimmers to make sure that you don't have any nose or any nasties up in there when you're doing shows. <clears throat> okay, that is my helpful hint to start things off. This is, um, I'm going to do a series of my beauty routines for you, step by step. So, I hope I teach you something. And sometimes it's best to be real and raw. Show them how you are normal, and then you become beautiful. And then at night when you're performing and entertaining, you're fabulous. I'm going to show you all of that. Right here on Pronoun TV and the Stephanie Stevens Show. Thank you. Oh, I can breathe better. Oh, look at that. Look at that. You see what a nose hair trimmer does. It makes you breathe.